why would you really expect a man to take care of you for your whole entire life? Like you should have had a plan B. And she knows all this, but I was really upset for a long time until I, you know, went through this take seven for myself over this situation. Remember, my complaint was that she, that I have to take care of my mom for the rest of her life because she was also having some health issues and I knew she couldn't keep doing hair forever. And so when I went through like all of take seven and I got to what's a better way of looking at this, I decided to take my power back in this moment and go, I always have a choice. So even though my mom didn't set herself up and has nothing to show for all of the work that she's done, and I'm going to have to take care of her, you know, all these things. I said, do I want to take care of her? Or could she, she could just become like a ward of the state or something, right? Like that could be a legit potential for her. And at the end of the day, I was like, I want to take care of her. And God has blessed me with an amazing gift and talent of being able to have multiple businesses and make a lot of money. And I like actually think it's cool that I can provide for my mom and give her a life that she never even would have had with my stepdad. The life that she has now, I don't think it was ever even possible for her, you know, being in that marriage. She has a life of luxury and freedom now. And I just decided to change my perspective in that moment and go, you know what? I am so blessed by God. He has given me more than enough to not only take care of my family very well and set them up for generations to come, but he's also made sure that my mom was going to be taken care of. 